That's like 46 energy drinks. They're just... This video is also for educational and entertainment purposes and all content used within is protected by fair use. Hello internet and welcome back to my channel. My name is Alex, otherwise known as Pugapilla across all my social platforms. And what we're going to be watching today is we're going to be watching Fear Street 1984 part one. It's part one of a three part trilogy, which I had no idea was going to release and it's releasing each week. There's like a full length movie releasing each week, which I've never heard of before. So that's what we're going to be watching. Now, from what I know, this is sort of like a slasher-esque, like very 80s type movie, or it's like influenced by them anyway. But then I remember that I haven't really seen any of the Nightmare on Elm Streets. So I haven't really seen any of the Halloween movies. I haven't really seen any Friday the 13th. There's a lot of them that I haven't watched. So that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be watching part one and then each week, uh, part two is already out. So I'm already late. <laughs> if you're new to the channel, hi, hello, how are you going? Leave me a comment. Yeah, man, I'm doing great it's i'm fucking balling right now how are you if you're not new make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss an upload because youtube doesn't tell people when i upload blah blah blah, blah, blah. grab a drink and some snackies and let's get into fear street 1984 i've made a severe lack in judgment and it's actually called fear street 1994 it really goes to show you how little i know about this <laughs> it began as a prank and ended in murder Oh, YouTube prankster. Have a nice night. Shadeside Mall is now closed. The Shadeside Mall is now closed. Shadeside Mall. Something shady is going to happen here. Hello, this is B. Dalton's. We're closed. Okay, since when do you work late? Dude, I thought he was holding a peg. <laughs> I thought it was a big inflatable peg. Ryan, hello. I think Ryan's hello. preoccupied. Night. When do janitors ever make that much of a sound? Oh, oh, oh fuck you! <laughs> Jesus! That's what she said. Yeah. You are disgusting. I don't understand people who can have a doll like that, look at it, and then fuck it. You know what you're essentially doing? You're fucking a balloon. They look like goosebump covers. Just lift the thing up, man! It's not locked! what's your emergency? Hello! There's a killer! He's chasing me around the ball! Ma'am, if you don't answer, I'm gonna dispatch help. I dig the guy's costume, but it looks like a fucking Halloween costume. <laughs> One of them's gonna be the killer. Oh, fuck! That's a stomach ache and a half! Okay, that mask is kinda creepy. Wait! I thought Heather was the main character! Dude, she was just trying to sell books for a living, man! Wait, what? What? Wow, that's a really short movie. In a house in a residential area the witch possessed him. Wait, is this all different type of... It's not one killer. Most beautiful place to live. Yeah, most beautiful place to live if you're alive. No wonder why the books look like Goosebumps books. The series is based on the books by R.L. Stein. Oh my god, man. Dear Sam, I hate you. <laughs> Dear Sam, go fuck yourself. Oh! oh <laughs> she, <laughs> she actually wrote that! What the fuck? Did you see? There was a massacre at the mall last night! The guy was wearing a mask! Dude, what the hell? This isn't yours, Dillweed. 
Oh. But why was he hiding under the sheet? I don't get that. <laughs> Just close the door. This internet bullshit is potentially exactly why you have no friends. It's not bullshit. I'm talking to someone online. They're called like Mark Zuckerberg or something. We're going to create this thing called Facebook. The one-handed witch Sarah Fire condemned him to... She's jealous. She's jealous of them too. And them? Come on, girl, just get a man. Dude, what a fucking edge lord. <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna fucking write rip on her locker, man, with a knife. <laughs> Wicked slave. She'll take your blood! Simon. She'll take your head. How long was that guy waiting in the toilet for? This is the girl's bathroom. I've got something that'll give you the balls to face, Sam. What? You're dealing again? I thought it was going to be like a box of donuts or something. That just goes to show you how much of like... <laughs> how much of a basic person I am. <laughs> As if that guy is allowed to fucking run around the school like that, man. Then you quit. Insane in the brain! Our hearts are broken with grief. So she obviously misses her ex, but then... How did they break up? I need to know. I'm such a snoop. Sam. I thought you quit band. Yeah, I did. Here. The light going out signifies that she's done with that relationship and she's moving on because the lights have turned off. You broke up with me, remember? So stop acting like I'm the bad guy. Yeah, well, I'm not the one who moved to Sunnyvale. Okay, you made the choice. I just made it official. Wait, you broke up with her just because she moved? Ever heard of a long distance relationship? I know it's 1994, but it wasn't that long ago, was it? Oh my god, it was almost 30... And I know that douchebag out there was squeezing your ass. You broke up with me. What's his name, Sam? His name is Peter! Best case is what? Dead on the mall floor after a double shift? Or maybe... Maybe if you're really lucky, you're the one carrying the knife. Yo! Suck it in red! Oh, fuck! What are we gonna do? We're gonna go kill those preppy assholes! Um, not the right terminology with everything going on. Alright, chill, not kill, okay? Oh, Sam, you fucking bitch. <laughs> Sunny Bell sucks. I didn't know it was a full moon tonight. Open the door. Open the door. What the fuck are you doing? No. You're going to kill them. That is not a good idea. Oh no. Are you honestly surprised that that was the result? Shit. Are you alive? Shit. Are you alive? Sam. Whoa. I'm, so, I'm sorry. Oh, dude, sorry ain't gonna cut it. You just fucking ruined that guy's car. His dad's gonna be pissed. She's fine. Oh my god. Oh. Before the crash, someone opened the emergency exit. I don't remember that. Oh, I don't like you. He also saw you with the cooler. Did anyone else see that? It was just an accident. Don't worry about fear straight. Worry about fearing that woman. Holy shit, the sun must have got out of bed late. He was really quick to go up into the sky. <laughs> He's like... Oh. Oh my god! It's 9am! I'm gonna lose my day job! 
Uh-oh. Someone's looking a little bit G-U-I-L-T. Why? Guilty. Brian Torres has been identified as the killer. Josh, get the door! Hello? That kid better not fucking die, I'm telling you. He's a rocker. Stop until you've ruined her life completely, will you? She's fine. Don't call here again. Ooh. Ooh. Josh! Hello? Oh, hey, Peter. See, you got the full costume now. Hey. Pizza ready? Oh, that ringing you heard. I have priorities. <laughs> Pizza is pretty good. Holy shit. Stay here. Holy shit, what if I don't get to eat my pizza in time? You're pathetic! How do you lose track of him? He was looking out the window the whole time! Pizza boy should have just been like, oh yeah, he just he just went behind the bushes. What happened to sorting this? Lights and darks and watch for stray socks. Remind me what's in it for me again. Some fresh socks. <laughs> that prick Peter is screwing with me. Sam's boyfriend? Yeah, he's creeping around our house in one of those skull masks. Call the police. It's a pretty obvious solution. Some dude's walking around the outside of our house with a knife. Sounds like a job for the police. Hey, creeper, what the f Oh, dude. Are you, are you sure everything's okay? Dude. Why would you wear the blood stain shirt out in public, you fucking moron? He had a knife. Whoa. With the kids there? That's whack. I'm gonna have a guess as to who this is. Sam. When I reckon she's been like mind possessed or something. Don't forget the most important part. Fuck Sam. Yeah, fuck her. She did fuck Sam at one point. They were partners. You coming or what? No, I'm not coming. I haven't got my pizza yet. What? Maybe I'm wrong. Because she seems to just be eating jelly. What are you talking about? I'm talking about your dipshit boyfriend. Last night he threatened to kill us. You're all fucking dead. No, Peter's been here. You need to call him right now and tell him to back off. This bitch is crazy. Perfect timing, asshole. Where's your stupid mask? Where's your stupid brain? Fuck's sake. You're so dumb. Of course he knows how to hack the fucking chocolate machine. <laughs> All you had to do was suck it up, literally, and swallow some sunny- You know what? <laughs> Sheesh. Have a nice goddamn bite. <laughs> Oh, and somehow that woman will still find a way to blame the boyfriend. I bet you it was a fucking projection. A lot of people trade hacks online. Nerd. Oh, I promise I'm not this wide. I just have my arms extended out sideways because it's comfortable. I don't look like that flathead fish from fucking SpongeBob. Where are the staff members is the question I have. Okay, now I understand why there's no staff around the hospital. What are you... Oh, dude, that is sort of terrifying in a weird way. All employee Ryan Torres has been identified as the killer. That was my second pick. I just didn't say it. I don't understand how, though. Supernatural abilities? I don't know. The witches may have cursed him. Around here, people show a little respect. They call me Sheriff Good. Sheriff Good? More like Sheriff motherfucking evil. <laughs> Oh, dude, my humor's so broken that I find that hilarious. Maybe because I make those jokes. We're hiding in plain sight. Yeah, just like Bundy. Weird place to bring Ted Bundy up, but okay. That's Ryan Torres. Yes, you guys must have made a mistake or something. Look. You police must have made a mistake doing your job, all right? I'm not qualified, but you definitely made a mistake. Okay. Oh. 
I almost pissed myself then. <laughs> Dude, if there's ominous singing, do not go towards it. What are you doing, man? Don't go near her. Are you okay? Do you, do you need help? What the? Oh. What the hell? Dina, what is that? Is that the cops? Dina has committed so many felonies at this point, it's unreal. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Holy fuck, okay. That's one way to keep an eye on the situation. <laughs> she was hot and normal until she attacked me with a fucking razor blade. <laughs> she was hot and normal. Was she singing something? What, was she singing a song like like an oldie, like an oldie song? Jesus, Rain Man, how the fuck do you know that? Oh, this guy's in his fucking element. Murdered her boyfriend, her friends, and then she killed herself, slashed her wrist. Why didn't I see this on the news? Because it happened 30 years ago. 1978. 16 years ago. That outfit's fucking sick, man. I want to see that guy. Harry Rooker. Local milkman slashes a bunch of housewives. 1922. Billy Barker. 1904. Drifter Guts Girls. And on and on. Look at this guy. What the fuck is that one? 1666. He's the first one recorded. Oh, that's the third movie, isn't it? <coughs> Sam? Question? Where are the parents? Are, are there no parents in this town at all? I haven't seen one, I don't think. Even in their own homes. There are people trying to kill us. Dead people. It's Sarah Fear. She's turning Shady Siders into killers. I, I mean, no one actually thinks that this witch shit is real. Yeah. Oh! Sam's gonna become a killer. Ever since she was executed, she's been possessing people, turning them into killers to take revenge on the town. It's like the nursery rhyme. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Sam is so gonna become a killer. Dina, you need to get out of there, man. All these massacres are connected to Sarah Fear. The witch's curse is real. Sam's gonna become a killer because she touched the grass and had the visions. Get out of there! I saw the witch. Please, just leave Sam behind and just go to a different country. And then... Oh my god, she, did she weird. touch the hand? She didn't touch the hand, did she? Oh, not just chance. Oh. oh my gosh. Oh! oh. Yuck! Fear. It's her. It's her grave. Sam disturbed her grave. She disturbed her grave by simply touching it. Could you imagine if you needed to piss in the woods and you accidentally pissed on this this woman's grave? There. We're sorry. Did it work? <laughs> We're so sorry. Oh no, don't kill him, man. I mean, at least if anyone gets injured, you have an ambulance. They're coming for me. What? I disturbed her grave. She wants me. I'm gonna say, I would be a terrible friend. I wouldn't even be a friend because I would say, you know what, if she wants her, just open the door, just problem solved. Scumass didn't care about us. Okay, he wanted this, Sam's blood. But he came to our house too. Tina. What have you got? Oh. Okay, so what do they do in Jaws? What they should have done in Jaws is just not go in the water. <laughs> it's a very simple concept. But that doesn't explain why the killer then killed people like the office worker and stuff. They didn't have any blood on their things. Tina, you have to get clean too. Not a single drop, okay? Rub a dub dub tag. I don't want to go in by myself. Oh my god, it's my time. Oh.
I understand you guys are exes, but in this current moment with the situation going on, there should be no form of attraction at all. What I mean by that is I couldn't look at my ex after I know she's being hunted by this evil satanic witch and be like, yeah, but those boobs, I gotta say, they look pretty all right right now. Josh, can you help me? My man's time to shine. Let's go, man. You got this. Oh, you cheeky devil. You cheeky devil, Sam. I knew you were a good one. Am I missing something right now? We were just being chased by some fucking weird murderer and now we're all horny. Is that how it works? Get a little bit scared. Get a little bit of, a little bit of juice down there. Okay, that must be how it works. Get chased by an axe and now we want to fuck. <laughs> yeah, did we forget that there's a f fucking murderers after us? <laughs> because we were a little bit horny. Wait, 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 wait. Did you all go to Pound Town? That must be how it works then. I need someone to chase me with an axe. Oh, very smart term. Hey, we didn't need to bring a poor mop into this, okay? What's the mop done? Now it's gonna get chased by the murderer. That poor mop probably had a family. Oh no, man. I would be shitting myself. <laughs> She was she's so sexy, but fucking crazy still. <laughs> <laughs> if this doesn't work, I will murder you. Uh, that doesn't make sense. Oh god, you guys have pissed Jason Voorhees off. God damn. Oh my god, I thought- Go, 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 go! I was wondering when someone would drop a bomb in one of those toilets. Oh! No! Oh my god, the murderers are- No! Oh, yuck! Yeah, you guys are fucked. We're fucked! No. Yeah, you are! Someone who has a brain! We put Sam in the hall, we end this now. You're a monster. I'm being reasonable. I agree with her. Just sacrifice Sam. Hey, all of this. Dead, dead, dead. This is the way. Someone been watching The Mandalorian? Seems like someone's been watching The Mandalorian. Oh, which murderer do you want to die by though? Like, which would you prefer? The Axe Man? Skull Man? Or like that weird, like, sexy ghost girl? Yeah, his words, not mine. What? 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 What's going on? I'm not doing this alone. What? There's another way. See Berman. She's the key. She, she survived, but, but first she died. Ah, oh, so they think she's dead. They leave her alone, then she respawns. We kill you. And then just like the sea Berman bitch, we bring you back to life. I bet you they use the tablets from earlier. They overdose her. Nice shot. Fucking scared the shit out of me, cat. What are you doing? Bananas! You need to take these in order. You don't have to do this. You can leave. That's so cheesy. Like the killers recognize what an X is. <laughs> They're dead. Oh shit! That person has an X on their chest. Can't hit anywhere else. What if we fuck up and just kill me? 
What if you can't bring me back? You're going to be really angry about that, Sam, aren't you? you you're not even going to realise. Potato chips, 89 cents? That's a fucking score! Grab some! It's like $3 a packet now. That's ridiculous. Josh is looking for the frozen pizza because he didn't get any earlier. <laughs> Be careful, you're going to burn the skin off his head! <laughs> He's going to pop up right in front of her, isn't he? He's going to be above her. Yep. Not the cake! No, thank you. <laughs> Jason Voorhees is slashing the prices in the store. <laughs> Ooh. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Fuck. No way. Oh! Holy shit! Oh my god! I'm never gonna look at a fucking bread slicer ever again! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Fuck! Oh no, that means Josh is gonna die, man! He didn't even get any pizza! Sam has left the chat. She has died. That means. Josh gets his pizza, maybe. Yes! Josh, grab as much pizza as you can, my man! You're doing it right. I think that might be a little bit too much adrenaline. That's like 46 energy drinks. They're just... When you think about it, this is all literally Dina's fault because she threw that, like, tub at the car and then that car went into the woods and that's where she touched a bone. Oh, yuck, she just vomited into her eyeballs. <laughs> hey, Dina, you might want to check on your other two friends. Uh, they're not in the best of conditions. Might be a little bit of a shock when you see them. <laughs> what are you doing? Are you gonna murder me? Can you at least wait till I finish the video? You look like a ghost. Like you just came back from the dead. I feel so bad for that store manager that went in the next day looking to do his usual 9 to 5 and stumbled across the bread slicer. <laughs> hey! Hey! Don't! Milo! Look at this cat! Dude! Milo! Oh, there is nothing in that brain, is there? Let's go. Let's go! <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to make the joke. <laughs> I had to do it. Sam. Samantha. Oh shit, we finally have some parents in this town. Strange they rock up in the last 10 minutes. <laughs> but you don't have to open it right now. Why wouldn't you just use a new bit of paper? She's gonna read the go fuck yourself and I wish you were never here thing. <laughs> just get a new bit of paper. Between us, whores in my head. Whores in Josh, someone's at the door. It's gonna be a Josh. murderer. Don't open it. What? He got the pizza! Yes! Hello? What's your favorite scary movie? I haven't seen the Scream movies either. Did you touch the bones? Did you see her face? No, oh, it's over. Over? She'll come for you. Oh no. Sam. Oh my god. I was right! I was right! Feeling like yourself. You 
think she's just a little bit sick? She has a tummy ache, a little bit of a fever. That bitch is a fucking murderer now. <laughs> Ah! That's one. That's one of the worst jump scares I've ever, I've ever seen. Summer of 1978, the first day of camp. Summer. No, she's meant to be in Stranger Things. Beer Street, 1978. I can watch it right now if I wanted to. But I'll do that. No! No! I don't want to! Stop! I don't, I don't want to watch it right now. Okay, so that was my reaction to Fear Street, 1994. I actually really dug that. I, I actually thoroughly enjoyed that. I think I really need to get onto watching all the Nightmare on Elm Streets and Halloweens and S the Scream movies because I've never seen like any of them. I'm also a massive sucker for like super cool looking killers and stuff, which sounds fucked. So if you're watching this and you're from like a police station or something, I just like the movies. I'm not going to do any killing. You know, I'm happy uploading on YouTube. Don't worry about me. I am definitely already keen to watch the second part already, especially if it's in like a summer camp. That is... Fuck yeah, dude. In terms of ratings, I'm actually going to give Fear Street 1994 a 3.5 out of 5. I really dug that. I'm no film critic or expert or anything. I'm just a guy who likes making videos and watching movies and making videos on watching the movies. <laughs> So if that's the takeaway, then I would like a large cheeseburger meal. Thank you very much. <laughs> and if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a big like or a little like, depending on your thumb size. Share this video with a friend or two. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you so much for spending a little bit of your time with me today. And I'll see you all the next time that we do this. And I'll see you then, unless, unless I get killed by a murderer. But I don't think that's going to happen. At least not yet.